just a short video this morning. Um, wanted to show you guys. Saw a saw a photograph on somewhere. I don't know where. I even saw. I can't find it again. Someone had printed some three D holders for UCs. And I really, really wanted to neaten up all of this, um, as well as make a permanent voltage rail for this active IB stage. So, um, uh, and, and of course, Ian is, is now uh, strongly advocates the permanent supply for the for the DAC and so forth. So, I'm going to try and have uh, five uh, UC Pure rails here, uh, all 3.3. Oh, well, this is five volt, uh, 3.3s. Um, so, so yeah, five. So actually six. So because there's a two, I've got to, I've got to reclock. I left the reclocker in on this on this Q7. So the five three point threes and then the one five one five volt and have that on all the time so it doesn't switch off. As well as uh, uh, building a linear power supply fifteen zero fifteen for for this thing, but which I'll get into another time. But um, yeah, so so that's led me to think about this space at the bottom here. So I've moved all this up, changed it all around a little bit, which you'll see in the. Yeah, later on uh, in another video, uh, but I'm going to have six of these in here. I think. Uh, well, it'll, it'll see, and I'm going to remove those three at the back because they're just mess. They're the first ones I built like four or five years or three, yeah, three years ago. Um, and, and so yes, these. This is really what I wanted to show you. Um, if I can work this one out here uh, for now. Yeah, it's just a 3D printed uh, PLA plus. Um, holder. Hmm. It'll take about eight, nine hours to print. Probably cost uh, six, seven pounds. All done without the time, I suppose. Um, yeah, and they slide in there. It's nice. It's, uh, it was actually very. I was actually very lucky on this one. Um, whew, measured it up, printed it, and it worked straight away. No, no, no amendments. The little board just slides in as well, so you can take them out in in and out easily. Um, and I guess. The main driver for this was, well, other than keeping the whole thing neat, was the ability to, to have them together and link them so that they can, uh, you know, you switch in the charging feature when, when the music's paused and that and that sort of thing, as well as have the cable through the center. There's a, there's a hole there. I wish I had nine hands. Um, you, can't, you can't see it. Can you see it? Yeah, there you can. You can see there's like a, a void in between, so all the cables can go through the middle. Um, yeah, it's nice and neat. And then the board just slides in. It doesn't clip in or anything, it just slides in. I mean, it looks a bit skew, but I mean, you know, you don't have to glue it and try and break the thing to get it off. So yeah, that's all I wanted to show you. Um, nice little thing. You guys are interested? Honestly, I don't know how to share details on here, but message me and we'll see if I can, yeah, share the CAD file or print you some up and send them to you. Let me know. Cheers.